I managed to find a used 90s bubble out soft drive for 15 bucks on the local bay. And my challenge was, could I make it into a player's frame? I have never used a 270 gram racket before and I wasn't going to start now. So I needed to replace the old grip, add lots of lead tape and change the strings. Lead tape is a cheap way to add weight to your racket and change the characteristics of the frame. Just beware to wash your hands after using it. Then you need a kitchen scale to weigh the racket and a balance beam to measure the balance. After adding plenty of lead tape around the top part of the hoop and on the handle, I got the weight up to 325 grams strung with an even balance. Quite the transformation. I strung it up with head hawk touch at 23 kilos and took it out for a playtest. I'm still struggling with a knee injury at the moment, but I'm at least trying to hit a bit with limited movement. The racket played stable and powerful with all the lead tape. In fact, I think I might have added too much, as it was a bit unwieldy at times. The older soft drive or pure drives have a more open string pattern, so the spin is quite sensational. The feel on the contact is raw and not dampened, so you know where you've hit the ball. A lot of pros like these older versions, like Fabio Fognini for example, and I understand why. If you compare this and the Pure Drive original to the newer version, I actually prefer these old models. They're a bit softer on the arm and slightly less powerful. I think a lot of modern rackets are too muted, which means you don't get enough feedback on where in the string bed you hit your shots. I haven't played a match with this racket yet, but on the whole I think this shows that you can take a used and bad condition 15 buck racket and make it into a nice weapon. I would say the customized soft drive played just as nice as a new $200 racket. I'm going to keep experimenting with this racket to see if I can find a perfect spec for it, but I'm already quite happy. Thanks for watching and I hope I can return to regular reviewing soon. As always, every like and share is appreciated. Thanks for checking out Tennis Nerd. Ah, sorry, sorry. Ah. Nice. Ah, too much.